Hello everyone, this is Ray Gano, and you're watching PZTV. How's everybody doing today? Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. This is the sad shape that the church is in today. American witchcraft rises as Christianity declines. As American Christianity slowly exits the scene, witchcraft has suddenly become popular again. According to the British Telegraph, or the Telegraph, number of Americans who identify themselves as witches now outpace the total number of Presbyterians. That's 1.5 million people, folks. As Christianity declines across the country, paganism has swung into the mainstream. I mean, just, just look at it, how popular the Harry Potter stuff is and everything. Um, you can go into like a Barnes & Noble store and you can buy magic wands, you can buy spell books. I mean, they, they got this whole section for it. I mean, they got uh, witchcraft for little girls and everything, every, an area for little girls. They got wizardry for little boys. They have all this stuff that you can buy and do. But again, Barnes and Noble, some of these other bookstores. Um, what is this? I forget what this one store is that you see in the shopping malls. But they're selling a lot of the, the witchcraft stuff and everything. The occult and witchcraft is really being pushed hard, folks, and pushed really bad. I mean, the show The Craft, um, Sabrina the Teenage Witch, which Nick, uh, Netflix just come out with. I mean, more and more shows dealing with witchcraft and actually pointing and painting this sort of thing as okay when it isn't. Christianity declines across the country. Paganism has swung into the mainstream with witchcraft paraphernalia for sale on every high street and practices normalized across popular culture. I mean, look at uh, the, the these witch covens coming across and every 21st of the month, and you don't hear about it anymore, but they're still doing it. Every 21st of the month, the witches are putting coming together and putting hexes on Donald Trump. Um, also, uh, there was... Uh, Judge Kavanaugh, also, same thing. They're putting hexes on Judge Kavanaugh. Witchcraft has become especially popular during the Trump administration. Following the president's victory over Hillary Clinton in 2016, witches gathered to cast a collective binding spell against him. They repeated this following con uh, confirmation of just Justice Brett Kavanaugh. According to Vox, a m many quasi-religious rituals were making their rounds in the halls of social media to self-help identified wishes, process, trauma, anger, and grief in the wake of Kavanaugh's confirmation of the Supreme Court. One popular spell, the gratitude spell, authored by Instagram user Celesta Light for the pagan political uh, organization Witch the Vote, that focuses on feminist causes. In this open-ended spell, participants might choose to make a sigil or a sacred sign on paper or vary their tribute to Ford in accordance to their own personal experience and history, uh, said Fox. And for example, what a sigil is, is you, you put together an idea or a spell comes to you and, and you just start slowly, you know, pulling out vowels and adding numbers and doing and what happens is the word after a while becomes some sort of symbol and um, in fact if you see that uh, that bumper sticker that says coexist that's a sigil and so it spells out something but it uses symbols and and other things to actually create the word but that in and of itself is probably one of the largest sigils out there in the known world uh, Another person, uh, D Dakota Brack Brackyall, a 29-year-old gender queer witch and co-owner of Catland Books and Witch Shop in Brooklyn, told the Telegraph the rise of witchcraft among millennials speak to their desire to find spirituality outside of a traditional marriage or traditional religion. Excuse me, um, but this is what we're seeing, folks, and and it's just amazing to me that uh, the enemy is winning, and we as Christians are letting him win. We've backed down from the fight, and so I don't know where all, the, all these soldiers are. Where are the Christian soldiers again? Where are the, 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 the last-day warriors? Huh? Where? I mean, we need to start standing up, and we need to start you know, taking the fight and start doing it again. But we're not. I mean, and, and I'm speaking especially to men. Men. I mean, basically, where's your cojones, bud? Where are your, where's your spine? Basically, let our role as the man be be subjugated to the women and allowing the women now to, to do the work. And, and the thing is, 
is if men don't stand up, then yeah, the women are going to take it upon themselves to do the right thing anyways, because they see the flaw, they see the hole in the, in the, in the gap. And so they themselves, since men aren't standing up and doing it, they're doing it themselves. So we need as men to start standing up and start doing it again. And speaking of that, what you need to do is you need to go regano.net. My old website, regano.com, uh, we're pulling, we're going, moving to regano.net. Eventually around the beginning of the year, we're going to pull the DNA, DNS name and put it back over to the new website. We were severely hacked, but on there, I'm going to have a whole area dedicated to the servant warrior. And that's what we need to do, folks. We need to start getting back up. The last day's warrior is where it's at. We are living in the last days. We need to start standing up and be the warriors for the Lord. There are people out there that I know that are being called to stand up and do this. So where are you? What are you doing? You know, are you going to allow this to win this or are you going to do something about it and start standing up and being a voice again for the Lord? We need to start doing this, folks. Um, I encourage you to go to regano.net and sign up and encourage to support our work here. We are in deep need of new subscribers. Become PZ Insider. We are really pushing hard. We're doing the new website and everything. There are some costs there that uh, we did not anticipate, and so we're we're you know getting those going as well as and everything. We are we're we're hammering the security big time on this, and so we're spending some extra money to really get security going. We've got daily backups now going, and uh, and so we're putting redundancy in place. We've learned our lesson from this last hack. We're not going to let it happen to us again. And we're just really hardening up and pushing forward. And so we need you to come on board and become a PC insider. Stand in the gap with us. We are on the front lines. We are fighting. And so we need your help. We need your support. Become a PC insider, folks. 20 bucks a month. You get the PC insider report. You get access to all the, the back, you know, back information, uh, our premier areas or premium areas, excuse me, and all the other stuff that we are offering. So help support us. Help us continue to put out videos like this, warning the world, warning the, the body of Christ. And again, just stand with us and become a PZ Insider. So that's what I wanted to bring to you today. Uh, Witchcraft is on the rise. And Christianity, Christianity is declining. So what are you going to do about it? The time is now. We are, lit, we are at a point of time where the final generation is ending. 2018, you can go read the article that I posted to my website. The final generation has ended in 2018. So from now on, it's all a crapshoot. We don't know what's going to go on. And so there's all these people saying, well, this is going to happen and that's going to happen. I mean, even said this is things that are going to happen. We honestly don't know. But what we do know is that we need to start standing up again. We need to start making a difference for not only ourselves, our families, our communities, and for our country. We are seeing things disappear, and they aren't disappearing for the good. They're disappearing for the bad. And the left is trying to destroy everything that's good. The family, uh, marriage, uh, sexuality, they're trying to destroy all of this. We can't let it happen anymore, folks. We need to stand in the gap and do something about it. So, again, what are you going to do? Become a PZ insider. That's the best thing I can do, tell you to do because then you can at least help us push forward and continue to get good stuff out. So we'll see you folks. Goodbye. God bless. I'm Ray Gano for PZTV. We'll see ya. Warrior on.